Speaking of outdoors, Peter Sinks, it's pulling some of the coldest temperatures in the country, dropping to 56 below zero just over a week ago. It's crazy. News specialist Mike Anderson spent some time inside the natural sinkhole today for a look at why it's a magnet for frigid conditions. With a quick snowmobile ride near the summit above Bear Lake, you can step into some extreme cold here, especially at night. If it's dead calm, the temperature at nighttime will just be plummeting. Alan Moeller is a research technician with the Utah Climate Center based out of Utah State University. We're pretty, pretty comfy right now, but if we were here you know, through just three hours ago, you know, it would have been well below zero still. And as he explains, the cold air overnight can leave just as fast as it rolls in, giving us some more comfortable temperatures here around 11 a.m., around the upper 20s to lower 30s. If you get just a little bit of airflow, even just like one mile per hour, that's enough to make the temperature jump back up by 10 degrees or more. But near dusk at Peter Sinks, the warm air quickly rises with little pressure up there at about 8,000 feet to keep it down. This is the high elevation bowl, so as the sun goes down, the cold air can get trapped down here, and sometimes the temperature down here and up there can be a difference of about 50 degrees. And sometimes when we get the uh, really extreme cold events, it's a combination of clear skies, no wind, and you know, maybe an Arctic front passed by. It makes it a fascinating area to study for researchers. The Utah Climate Center has maintained a permanent station here since 2009 with another one at the rim of the bowl to monitor the difference. And because it's a sink, there's no outlet for that air to go, so it just pools up. It's just the right combination of conditions in the right area to make it the coldest spot in the lower 48 states. The topography is really just this, almost this perfect bowl situation and it just makes it most efficient. In Logan Canyon, Mike Anderson, KSL 5 News. Now we know, makes sense, yeah. sinkhole. There you go. Yeah, they actually <laughs> hold the record for the coldest temperature in Utah at 69 degrees below zero wow. Fahrenheit. How, how do you survive that? Nobody yeah. does, yeah. nothing does. And it almost 70 below is the actual coldest for the lower 48. So oh. they're monitoring it. We want yeah. the record. Right, right. right. Yeah. Well, you just don't exp monitor it, don't experience it, right? Yeah, well, <laughs> yeah. In order to actually get it official, you got to be there to experience <laughs> But all the same.